here. Samsung <laughs> reportedly plans to update Galaxy Note 7 software to prevent the smartphones from overheating. The company recalled the Galaxy Note 7 this month because of reports that lithium, lithium ion batteries are exploding and causing fires. The FAA has warned flyers about using the phones on commercial flights. Chris Van Cleve is at Reagan National Airport. That's just outside Washington with the steps airlines are taking to reduce the risks. Chris, good morning. Good morning. Lithium ion batteries are in virtually every rechargeable electronic device. I went through my bag here and found the MiFi that has one. Phone charger has one. Of course, the cell phones have them, as does my laptop. A recent report estimated for a flight with 100 passengers, there would be 500 lithium ion batteries on board. An explosion like this inside an airliner has concerned the FAA for years. As this demonstration shows, even a small lithium ion battery can pack a powerful punch if it malfunctions. Richard Hargrove is a software engineer at Cadex Electronics, a Canadian company which tests batteries for Samsung and other companies. They are volatile, but with effective electronics and uh, casings, they are perfectly safe. We had a a uh, failed device that kind of exploded, caught on fire. In October, this Alaska Airlines flight made an emergency landing in Buffalo after a handheld credit card reader caught fire. It is one of at least 11 incidents involving lithium ion batteries on passenger planes reported to the FAA last year. Five others were reported on cargo flights. George Crabtree of the Argonne National Laboratory says the most serious overheating problems are caused by an out of control chemical reaction. That fire can go on for minutes or hours before it finally simply runs out of fuel. Samsung blamed a manufacturing flaw for the faulty batteries in its newly released Galaxy Note 7. The FAA says passengers should turn off that device and not charge it during flights. Some foreign airlines have banned the smartphone altogether. As of April, lithium-ion batteries are no longer allowed in checked bags or as cargo on commercial flights. But the batteries are found in just about every rechargeable electronic device, including laptops, tablets, and children's toys. But I don't think it's every lithium-ion battery that one has to worry about. The incidents occur in batteries that are defective, and they're not normal for one reason or another. Now, the airlines say issues with these batteries are exceedingly rare, but when they fail, it can result in fires that burn extremely hot. In fact, some airlines have started carrying special containers that you could put a laptop or other device that's melting down inside of and would contain the fire. Josh? Chris, thank you. Hard to believe they're just only discovering yes. this now. And very scary as you travel on planes. You have to rely on people to do the right thing and not plug in Let's your Let's all phone. do the right thing.